Pancreatic cancer is still considered to be an incurable disease. Only 20% of people will survive after their first year of diagnosis, and only 6% will survive to live another five years. In 2014, we formed the Team Corona Foundation. We want this to expand further. We need to get that mentoring out to the local community. Volunteer, or to sponsor, or to donate. Continue driving awareness. Help other cancer victims. Fundraising. And getting sponsors. Got the Team Corona uh, scholarship now. Everyone came together to help a friend in need. Have a much greater impact. That's the legacy that I want to see carry on. And hopefully, someday, we're going to shut down cancer. Thanks for your support. One, this shutdown cancer music fest, as you can tell, last year was Carrie for Corona because it was about something that hit home with me and my family. But this year, the music fest and shut down cancer isn't just about me. It's about all your friends and family, and it's about that young girl right there. Someone's born to take life safe and easy. I was born to live life on a dare. I never worried about the fall, y'all. Just how high I got in the air. Flipping dirt bikes and rolling daddy's truck The highs kept me smiling through the tears I'll take years off of my life Before I take life off my life So, in one of my runs, I realized, you know what? We could do something about this. You know, pancreatic cancer is the number four killer. By 2020, it's going to go to number two if we don't change that. So that's our mission. We're out there to, you know, fund cancer research, help families fighting, and provide scholarships for children that are affected by this cancer, unfortunately. towers and county quarries no trespassing men come on in skydiving drunk now there's your story and giving that farmer's bull a spin hello this one's for you and let's sew on this helmet and whoever gets this i personalize whatever you want on it and you can take this thing home and uh, run it to your family members all day long God bless you, Haley. You're here tonight. Fuck it all, Haley. Before I take life off my ears, I love the view up on this high wire. Pulls out a net down the low. While most are running from the wildfires, well, I can't wait to get to. You sip your water, I'll drink my beer. Yeah, I'll take years off of my life. For I take life off of my years. I take a couple years off of my life. For I take life off of my life. Well, I'm Vince Cruz. Uh, I'm part of Team Chrome. With with Rick's diagnosis, was it really opened up my eyes to what cancer really is? You you hear it on the TV, you see it, you might hear it from a friend here and there, but when it really when it happens to someone you know personally, it's obviously a, a, a different. It's a it's it's different. 
and I want this to expand further. I want I want to be able to to get the word out. I want Rick. I want Ricky's story to get out. I want people to understand and. I know that word is kind of stagmented, you know, and, and, and to you know, open up people's eyes to this. But I, I think if you hear and listen to Ricky's story, you'll get a very, very clear understanding of what cancer is. Rick is a living, breathing miracle, a medical impossibility, a case study of one. He is beating the odds, and he lives every day with the full intention of rewriting the book on defeating pancreatic cancer. Hey Rick, Big Boss Hog here. You know the Bug Commander boys love you, we're praying for you, we're thinking about you. But I got a few other friends who want to say hello. Rick, it's Tyler Jordan, my dad Bill here right beside me. We just want to let you know you're in our thoughts and prayers. We're thinking about you, buddy. Hey Rick, Tiffany Lukoski here, coming at you from Iowa in one of our crushed clover fields, actually. Man, I'm just really wishing the best for you and your family. Um, I know you're going to fight hard. For Rick, for myself, and all the guys at Team Primos, and the entire Primos family, we want to take just a minute and say thanks for everything. We're thinking about you, and we're wishing you the very best. My man Rick, what's up, buddy? Just want to let you know that I am proud to be on Team Carone. Big Rick, we want to wish you the best from Wild Game Innovations, Wild Game Nation. Well, Rick, Jeff Danker here, Buck Ventures, Major League Bow Hunter. Just want you to know, buddy, we are uh, bathing you in prayer every day. We're going to be praying. You know, Jordy told us what was up, man, and everybody here in my family, my community, my church, everybody's praying for you. There are a ton of guys out there, buddy, that think the world of you. Rick, just wanted to let you know, buddy, there is not a single person I know, nor here down here in Fort St. George at the Bone Collector office that isn't thinking about you. And just want to let you know, buddy, we are praying for you. We're there for you. Hey, Rick. Uh, David here at Realtree. I just wanted you to know, buddy, that um, uh, you've got so many people praying for you. Boy, it's off it. Just wanted to give you a quick note and let you know we're thinking about you, man. Uh, on behalf of the Offit family here, we're on vacation, and our 6,000 employees in Baltimore from Under Armour, we're pulling for you, brother. Hey, Rick. We just wanted to let you know, buddy, we're all thinking about you, man. Hang in there. You're going to beat this thing. Just remember, the strongest thing in the world is prayer. And you got a lot of good people praying for you every day. So hang in there, man. All right, Rick, there you go, man. Put a smile on your face. Know that there's a lot of people out there praying for you, and we love you. Go with God, man. You beat cancer by how you live, why you live, and in the manner in which you live.